For as long as humans have existed, we've looked at other animals and wondered what it would be like to be able to do what they can do. Eagles fly through the air and swoop down to grab their prey. Spiders climb on vertical or even upside down surfaces with these. Dolphins curve through the ocean like it isn't even there. There are some amazing things in the nature. Mother Nature is a huge classroom that offers many lessons for those who take the time to reflect and discover. Scientists and inventors study characteristics of things in nature and come up amazing technologies and products in winters as a result of studying nature. Our lives would be totally different without technology. Some of those technologies are disconnected from nature, as you can imagine, but others would not exist without seeing what is possible through nature. Biometry is an approach to innovation that seeks sustainable solutions to human challenges by emulating nature's time-tested patterns and strategies. So, biometry is having biologists join physical engineering teams to help solve the most complicated problems. Now, I would like to see you a short video clip about B12 spirit. Probably the most obvious example of nature-inspired technology is B12 spirit. A bird in hand is worth two in the bush. We've all heard this expression before. It ostensibly means that a certain smaller position is worth more than a greater potential. This bird depicted on this screen is the peregrine falcon. Peregrine falcon is a specific of eagle. According to the United States military, this bird is worth so much, more than two birds hanging out in a bush. It is worth billion. Another fabulous example of using nature's wonders in our technologies is the advancement of trains and the make of bullet trains. The flight of the kingfishers were taken as the base for the theory of bullet trains. Bullet train is a system of transportation that uses magnetic levitation to sustain, guide and propel vehicles from magnets rather than using mechanical methods such as friction-reliant wheels, axles and bearings. But one of the problems that was caused by this was the loud boom. The scientist explained that the reason for this was the build of noise cushion of fear. As a solution, they applied the shape of the beak of the kingfisher at the front of the train to make it quieter and more aerodynamic. The fastest passenger bullet train to this date has broke its own speed limits on a test run with an astonishing speed of 600 km per hour. Isn't that marvelous? This way passengers can travel between countries in a more few hours. If we look at the advancement of trains, it was the German engineers who first sought out high-speed trains in 1899 and in 1964 Japan capitalized on high-speed trains. In 1981, a Chazar revolution began in Europe starting with France. In this revolution, a diesel-powered drain car was modified with a gas turbine and it reached 230 km per hour. Another example for biomimetry is ship hull coating. Ships, especially naval vessels, constantly struggles to look clean and cut through the water quickly. Algae, microbes and other things can easily build on submerged part of ships. It increases drag, waste fuel and reduces maximum speed. To solve this problem, researchers examine the sharks. These animals are so perfectly evolved through the seas. Scientists found that sharks have self-cleaning, antimicrobial and super flood dynamics in their scales. Now most expensive vessels are coated in a finished mimicking shark scale. This is also used to reduce air resistance in some aircrafts. So it is an obvious fact that is the wonders of nature 
that gave humanity their greatest inventions. So let us preserve nature in our pursuit of higher development and advancement of technologies.